Let's give a warm welcome for the award-winning Beyond Vaudeville program with your host, Frank Hope, and his co-host, David Green.
you doing? Well, you're familiar with the uh, eight, of course. And, right? and uh, what else? Uh, uh, well, my uh, movie, uh, DC Cab, is available in all the fine <laughs> Okay. And, uh, uh, oh, uh, what was it like to work with um, George Papard? <laughs> with the show. Uh, we have a very uh, special lineup tonight uh, and a uh, very uh, special uh, guest star. So please welcome the one and only, the inimitable, Mr. Pat Cooper. Yeah! You never saw me here. I thought I saw it all, ladies and gentlemen, until tonight. So from now on, I'm gay. It's wonderful to be here in Caroline's under these conditions. A fucking wreck. People say, how come you're doing this show? I don't know. I was in a bus and this guy with the lip hanging over his perutza said to me, can you come to Caroline to 28? I said, certainly. But he didn't tell me why. This is why. I will never do this again. Because I was told if I do good tonight, I could wind up being a Mormon in Utah. But it's wonderful because Fordable, ladies and gentlemen, I was born in that era. It was great Fordable in those days. Tonight is peculiar. <laughs> and entertainers in the back that are biting at the bit. They want to become stars. They ain't gonna become nothing. <laughs> but, but, we finish, don't get cocky. But, it's a start. From here, if they do good, they work across the street. <laughs> because they can't afford traveling expenses. <laughs> It's nice working on a pumpkin here, got a whole asshole. I took a shower, goddammit, I feel I wasted it. I'm 65 next birthday, who the fuck needed this? I can't, but the real stuff got two shows now, one over here and one over here. I love it. We're only kidding around. It's going to have a great night because i got to move along because the young lady has to go someplace and she's in a hurry. She's a wonderful lady and we want to bring her on. Please welcome Miss Suzanne. Yes. Del 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 Del
My God, I know money is the blue flame, ladies and gentlemen. Who knows next week? The torch. I tell you, I'm sitting back there watching this go on. I'm saying, they're over talented. There's too much fucking talent in this room here. My career is in jeopardy, ladies and gentlemen. You think it's easy? It's not easy. Standing back there, a man of my caliber, work Las Vegas, Atlantic City, and then wind up that I have to make it here tonight or I'm out of the business. There's talent back there fighting, trying to get through the walls. But I want you to know one thing. They came in here very quiet, very unassuming, but they're waiting for you. They're back there waiting. They're all made up, dressed in what they got to do because they got to give them. But what I tell you right now, they're all disguised, but they don't want you to know who they are. Freedom are I'm most wanted. Never say that again. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, to keep going along. We got a man here that's one in a billion. He's the only one of his kind. He traveled all over Asia. He worked the China Wall. He worked the basement in the Yucatan. He's also the man that sings with his nose. Because he's got lockjaw. I want you to give him a nice hand. He's worked all over the, probably the biggest places in the country and a few places in the city. Say hello to Jim Grosso, ladies and gentlemen. The singing man. He whistles, he don't sing. What do you feel? Would you do me a favor? Who gives a shit? Ladies and gentlemen, I'm going to do two songs. I'm going to whistle them out closed. Uh, Waverly and Ari the Deutsche Moment.
I think he just blew his nose on the fucking floor. And I found all that's all. Anyway, what are you gonna do? Tigers always do that. It's Merengue time, ladies and gentlemen. Man, it's worked all over the southern continent. Peru, Peru, and Peru. And he got lost in Brazil, ladies and gentlemen, looking for the gorillas. That's the gorilla laughing, ladies and gentlemen. He's a marvelous gentleman, a good sport. He's come all the way from 38th Street and 13th Avenue in Brooklyn. He's going to give it a meringue to fabulous entertainer, Jimmy Del Rio, ladies and gentlemen. Right here, Jimmy Del Rio. Que pasa, que pasa.
Don't eat your ass out. Hey, come out here, spice saying in a different language to give you some culture. You know, stay right on your turn around and understand that I go out now and get mugged by a Puerto Rican. You don't fool around, other continental things going on here tonight. Treat the, in about three minutes, we're going to get a Yugoslavian up here. We start another war in Bosnia. And I'm sticking to the goddamn floor from that fucking nose singer there. That son of a bitch, I'll kill him. This is stuck on a piece of linguine. By the way, all the yellow cards, these orange cards, ladies and gentlemen, please fill them out because there's going to be a raffle here. We're going to give away Jimmy Del Rio. I'm not being funny. Please fill them out because there is going to be a, 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 a raffle and uh, we want everybody here to win. Uh, but unfortunately, nobody's going to win because it's a scam, ladies and gentlemen. Because anything on us today don't make money, you gotta be a rat bastard, you know that. <laughs> anyway, so okay, I'll put this over here, sir. And we're gonna go on now with the man. I know there is a two drink man. You heard of Frank Sinatra? He's sick when he hears this guy. Harvey Como robbed this impossible from this guy. The song of it's impossible because this guy is impossible. <laughs> I think I lost you, ladies and gentlemen. Anyway, our next guest is from, is from Belmore, Long Island. Yeah. 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 That's a nice yeah. And when he's asking, he's campaigning the White House to promote long-lasting and more loving family relationship. Why? <laughs> Tonight he performs the first song he ever wrote, Don't Cry, Crunchy Wunchy. A big hand for Spiker, ladies and gentlemen. And there was cereal crackling all around. And hence, when I got up in the morning, I wrote, Don't cry, crunchy, wunchy. Yeah. Striker! I didn't mean to hurt you, honey. I wouldn't hurt you for the world. Oh, 
sunny Long Island. Uh, and this game is strong. Next time I come, I'll do it all strong. But we have cheery folks with don't give up spirit. Pretty scene, can't you hear it? As they greet the new day along with
I'll let you know. By the way, this is a participation event. I expect you all to learn the chorus on this. Oh dear, what can the matter be? Replicants infiltrate society. They
You had to turn up somewhere? You turned up here tonight. As a girl. This young lady's been on a lot of the shows, the Joe Franklin show, the Ray Hedderton show. She's on shows with Grandpa, Grandma, and Uncle Teresa. Let's give a nice hand to the Elvis Roberta. No, I did that already. Roberta's not here. This is D Mac. D Mac, ladies and gentlemen. Thank <laughs> you. 
keep going. So uh, uh, just uh, bear with us and we'll bring the lights up and pay quick collect the cards. All right, uh, uh, Michelle Lipschitz.
was who gets a who gets a prize for the best costume. Everybody, come on, come on up.
you won already, huh? Eh? What'd you win? A picture of hell. What the hell is that, for Christ's sakes? I gave that away when I, when I moved out of my apartment. I threw it in a toilet, for crying out loud. But you want something, pal. Why? That's the best costume? If a blind guy was in here, he'd win. That's the best costume? Really? Well, that's wonderful. Who are you supposed to be, man? Yes, I hate to ask. Charlie Brown. Charlie Brown? Get it? Get it? Look like a peculiar radio if I'm right now. Anyway, I would! Fucking got babies coming. Look at that people without my glasses. From his days of the kosher comedy, when he wanted with such such as Moisha Pippick and Pink. He cuts the peddler through the story by a whole new generation of fans with the all-time number one classic shaving cream. Our next guest is a true show business legend. Let's welcome in the incomparable Benny Bell. Ladies. Yeah! Nice to be with you, take my way to the street. Now before my act is done, I know we'll have a lot of fun. So how do you do, 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 how do you do? Oh, oh. Yeah. Yeah. You have no idea how happy I am to be here. At my age, 88, I'm glad to be any place. Yeah. I have a memory like a fish. I don't remember my life. I need a cue sheet like this one. So if I fumble a little bit, forgive me. I'll catch up. Now, first of all, let me remind you that because Monday falls out on Tuesday, this coming Wednesday, the program scheduled for Thursday has been postponed from Friday to Saturday because Sunday is a legal holiday. Remember that. Now, my first number is a jukebox song. When the jukeboxes came out, they would never would play this on radio. But on the jukeboxes, I got away with almost 50 years ago. Every couple of years it comes by. So uh, let me see. This is it. Go take a ship for yourself. Remember that one? <laughs> Every time we take a trip, you always get my goat. I like trains and buses, but you like a ferry boat. Well, the next time we go traveling, ships out, out, I now declare. You go your way, I'll go mine, I'll meet you over there. Da -da -da -da. Go take a ship. For yourself, da, 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 da. I'll go by train by myself. Da, 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 da. If you can fly a train, ride in buses or a train, then go take a ship for yourself. Da, 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 da. Take a battleship, an excursion ship, or a fishing ship will do. And if you can't take a big ship, then take a small canoe. La, la, la. Oh, voyage to you, my friend. Da, 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 da. I'll meet you at the journeys and da, 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 da. If you like grindy seas, rolling waves and ocean breeze, then go take a ship for yourself. Da, 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 sailing, sailing over the bounding main. Maybe that gives you pleasure, but it gives me an awful pain. Sailing, sailing over a crazy notion to take a little trip out in the middle of the ocean. So go. Pay for shit for yourself. Yeah. I found an onion, I found an onion, I found an onion just now. Just now, I found an onion, I found an onion just now. Where did you find it? Where did you find it? In an ash can, in an ash can, just now, just now, in an ash can, in an ash can, just now. What did it taste like? What did it taste like? What did it taste like? Guess what? Yeah, good. 
Good guess. But you know, you join, you join in the chorus. I have a sad story to tell you. It may hurt your feelings a bit. Last night when I walked into my bathroom, I stepped in a big pile of shame and free. Be nice and clean. Shame every day and you'll always look keen. I think I'll break off with my girlfriend. Her manners are rude, I admit. Each time I say, darling, I love you, she tells me that I'm full of shame and dream. Be nice and clean. Shame every day and you'll always look keen. Please, an orchestra. I once watched this well game on baseball. The batter, he slammed out a hit. And while he was running to first base, he slipped out a big pile of shade and green. Be nice and clean, shade every day, and you'll always look keen. Our baby was eating some peaches. We thought that she swallowed a pit. Next morning we looked in her diaper and we found it all covered with shame and green. Be nice and clean, shame every day and you'll always look clean. I once watched a funny performance of a Romeo Juliet skit. When Julius said, wherefore art thou? He replied, I am taking the shame. Be nice and clean, shame every day, and you'll always look And now, folks, my story is ended. I think it is time I should quit. If any of you feel offended, stick your head in a bucket of shame.
I pick up on my telephone. I call my sister Lee. But she says, do not worry, we are bringing Susan D. Susan D. Susan D. Susan D. We want that woman in the White House, Susan D. I need a letter, Susan D. Susan D. Susan D. We want that woman in the White House, Susan D. Susan D. And that member of the movement, I'm as proud as I can be. Anything that I am called upon to do, I will agree. I feel equal with my sisters, and I know they're best for me. So I'd like to let me get right now. Susan B. Susan B. Susan B. Susan B. I know better than my sister, Susan B. Susan B. Susan B. Anthony. I feel equal with my sister, Susan B. That is one more song I'm going to do for you.